Hello, pals. This is Holly. It's time for the sequel that no one's been asking for. Airplane 4, The Final Flight. Follow me on Roblox. Can you remember what happened during Airplane 1, 2, and 3? Me neither, but I'm gonna guess it doesn't actually matter. <gasps> it's Dad! Whoa, this is weird. It actually looks exactly like my dad. Who did this? Dad's like, wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Okay, I've never heard my dad say anything like that before, but wait, did you make me breakfast? Dad's like, what? Don't tell me you forgot. Forgot what, Dad? Today is the big day. Is it? Is it the day we're going on a big flight? Are we going on holiday? Let me remind you, we are flying to the Rohamas. Get down here. Oh my gosh, the Rohamas. That sounds so delightfully made up. Number one objective, go find dad. Get up, everyone. We're going to the Rohamas. Wow, looks like I share a room with like five of my siblings. That's pretty fun. Okay, come on down and stairs, everybody. We've got to find dad. We've got to pack our bags. We have a holiday. Oh, oh, maybe. Oh, no. Dad says, oh, my. None of you have done your baggage. Wow, we should have packed last night. Dad's like, I can't believe you forgot. We don't even have time. That's it. Whoever doesn't have the baggage ready before breakfast is not going on the trip. No, Dad, you can't do this to me. I've been looking forward to this trip for like 90 seconds. I will pack everything. I will. Dad says, I will start making the burgers in the backyard. Hurry up. <gasps> wow, breakfast burgers. That's a bit unexpected. Okay, I'm going to do my packing. And I got to do it quick. And I definitely need to bring my favorite cookie shirt. Like I bring my cookie shirt. Please, please bring, the, bring the cookie shirt. Can't go on vacation. Maybe my light, lightning bolt shirt. Or maybe any of this. Kayla says, I really want to go to the trip. What are we going to do? Oh, we're going to pack at like lightning speed. Rain's like, I don't even remember where my clothes are. Okay, clothes are in the closet. We're looking at them right now. Renza Koto says, okay, here is what we're going to do. We have 45 seconds to explore the house and see where everything is. Then we start packing. Okay, uh, I think that pretty much everything I need is going to be right here. Like my cookie shirt. This is the most essential item because everybody in the Rohamas needs to know how much I like cookies. And if I'm not wearing my cookie shirt, how will they know that I want them to offer me cookies? Did you know I have a star code? My star code's Cunicorn. You can use it if you like. All right, we've only got 30 seconds left. Okay, so I've checked out the locations of my toothbrush and my toilet duck. Uh, those are both pretty important things for the vacation of the Rohamas here. Okay, let's see what else we got in the house. Okay, another bedroom. That's all in order, I suppose. What about here? Pink bedroom. Oh, no, I've already been here. Um, okay, we've only got two seconds left, and then I think it's time to start packing. Oh, it's me. Okay, guys, time to start packing. Let's go. Okay. Oh, we got to find the purple pants. Purple pants. Uh, these are shoes. They are not purple pants. Uh, oh, no, is that them? Oh, I think I found them. Yes. All right, I've got the purple pants. Don't worry, guys. I'm going to take it to the take it to the bags. If you just would look after some uh, other items. Oh, I thought I could jump down the stairs, but apparently not. All right, run down the stairs. Da, 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 pack in my purple pants. Cool. All right. Item number one complete. You're welcome, everybody. Wait, what about my next item? <laughs> this is weird. What's my next item? Maybe I'll go get my cookie shirt. Okay, what do we got here? Should I take some of this? Take any of these things? <laughs> no, what am I supposed to be packing? <laughs> There's only a few seconds left. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm going on holiday and all I'm taking is one pair of purple pants. Wait, that's not what's actually happening, is it? <laughs> We're out of time. Oh, oh, oh no, it was just for the first item. Okay, now I gotta find, uh, find some sneakers. Okay, let's check in the closet here. Is it these ones? Oh yeah, I've got them. I am good at this game. What's going to be next? Could be toothbrush. Could be toilet duck. Hmm. I like how all of us are just packing like one item at a time and then running back up and down the stairs, bringing things down like individually. Okay, I've got 20 seconds just to chill, I think, until my next item appears. <laughs> There's just like people running around everywhere like, oh, where are my purple pants? Where's my toilet duck? I'll just chill here for a sec. I like how the music is like super dramatic. Very dramatic packing music. <laughs> okay, next item, ready. What is it? Oh no, someone fell down. <laughs> Get up, we've got a pack. Oh, my unicorn shirt. All right, I'm pretty sure that one is here. Got it. All right, wow, whole 40 seconds to walk down the stairs. I am so good at packing. If anybody else needs a hand with the packing, I have 30 seconds to spare, so. Hmm, maybe I'll see what dad's doing. Making those breakfast burgers. Can't believe we get to have burgers for breakfast. That is amazing. 
My bag is looking pretty full, but I think I've still got room for a few more things in the Rohamas. Oh my gosh, after the Rohamas, we should totally go to Cunicorn Islands. It's actually a pretty exclusive holiday resort. Um, by exclusive, I actually mean that everybody is invited. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, options. Options if we get tired of the Rohamas, we can always go to Cunicorn Island. Um, okay, so next item. I'm ready for my next assignment. Oh, it's dad. Burgers are almost ready. Leave it to dad to have a barbecue breakfast. He loves it. All right. Um, I guess that means that's all I'm taking to the Rohamas. I've got uh, one outfit and hopefully that'll do. So let's head out to the backyard. Oh, our house is amazing. Look at the swimming pool. Just swim to the other side here. Uh, dad, these burgers, they smell delicious. The whole family's come down to the barbecue. Everyone wants to make sure that they get a breakfast burger before we head out on our long flight, which I'm sure will go perfectly smoothly and be completely uneventful, um, as is um, usual in airplane stories. Um, so I'll grab a burger, Dad, whenever you're ready. Ooh, there's one burger there that looks a little bit questionable. Dad, that green burger, was it on the barbecue when you got here this morning? Oh, nope, looks like we're ready. I better sit down and get my spot at the table. Yeah, come sit next to me. Dad says, who wants a burger? Me, please. Anyone except for that green one. That looks pretty moldy. I do. I'm so hungry. And you know what they say about airplane food. All right, Dad says, all right, whoever wants one, take a seat at the picnic table. All right, I'm already here. I'm waiting. I know what happens at breakfast. Ready for my burger. Come on, Dad. We gotta get to the airport soon. Look, one of my sisters has already got her <laughs> she's already got her suitcase. <laughs> and brought it to breakfast. All right, Dad's gonna serve. Oh, one for me. Thank you. <gasps> and I didn't even get the moldy one. Amazing. Hope that nobody gets the moldy burger. Let's keep an eye on an eye on this. Okay. Okay, Dad, don't give anyone the moldy burger. That one's for you, okay? Has everybody got one? That looks good. And that's all. Enjoy. Let's taste this burger. I think it's got cheese and lettuce. Maybe even like a fried egg on there because it's breakfast burger. Mmm, delicious. Oh, on the radio it says, hello everyone. We are back on Bloxia State News. Should we listen to the news? There might be some sort of important announcement that is relevant to our upcoming flight. Earlier this month, the president congratulated the brave heroes that saved his life aboard the presidential plane. Wow, those brave heroes. Wonder who that could have been. Dad's like, whoa, can you imagine saving a plane? Uh, Dad, didn't you know that was me? I was actually on that plane and I saved the president. However, the president said in conference, as we landed, the suspect somehow disappeared. Hmm. The police warns everyone in Robloxia to be careful and report anything that could be useful for this case. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna keep an eye out and see if, if I can see anything useful. Dad says, how could someone possibly escape from something like that? I mean, that is a good question, Dad. <gasps> Dad says, oh my, look at the time. Wait, are we, we're not gonna be late for our flight, are we? We're running late to our flight. There is no way we'll make it in time. Dad, why did we have to have breakfast burgers? Dad's like, unless, follow me. Oh, okay, he's got some sort of plan. What's what's your secret plan? Maybe there's an underground tunnel that, that directly connects with the airport. Or maybe dad has family uh, jet packs and he's been waiting for the perfect opportunity to show us all of our brand new jet packs and we're gonna use them to fly to the airport. Um, oh, ooh, or Renza Koto says, I have a bad feeling about this. Why, is our dad like a mad scientist or something? Okay. Renzakoto has got a bad feeling, but I feel like maybe dad has something up his sleeve and he's going to get us to the airport on time. <gasps> oh my gosh, have we got our own plane? Maybe we've got a helicopter and we can take the helicopter to the airport. Oh, Kayla says, the garage? Yeah, uh, what kind of plan is this? Dad's like, wait for it. Just wait, he's got something planned. Dad says, I present you... Your very own small plane! <gasps> you are joking! <gasps> airplane 4, I get my own airplane! This is amazing!
flying my plane over here at the back. Oh, I'm front and center. We get to fly to the airport to catch another plane. That's funny. You're so right, Rain. Um, it's also a lot more fun than walking. Oh my gosh, we were going to walk to the airport. That would have taken us forever. Wow, I'm like the leader of the formation. Dad's like, now we can't lose any more time. Find your plane and grab a seat. Is anyone going to tell us how to fly the planes? <laughs> is it just like, we're just going to guess. We're not even wearing like helmets or anything. Just ready to fly. All right, five seconds and I'm taking to the sky. Oh no, everyone get in the planes. Okay, I think the door is opening. <laughs> oh, I'm really scared. I've never done this before. Dad's like, I'll see you guys on the other side. Are you not flying? Dad, where are you going? Wait, we don't even know how to fly these. Why isn't dad coming with us? He's like taking the train. He's like driving to the airport right now. Lemmy's like, we're just going to have to find out. Be careful with the obstacles. <laughs> obstacles? What do you mean? Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm obviously going to try to not crash the plane into anything. Oh, okay. All right. Flying up, flying down. This doesn't seem very efficient. Oh, I can't take the corner. No. Oh, no. <laughs> this doesn't really feel like flying a plane. It's kind of more like a helicopter, I guess. Oh, no. Someone crashed. Didn't they hear about the obstacles? <laughs> okay, I don't know if this is really the fast option we were promised. Excuse me, don't bump me. This isn't bumper cars. Oh no. Oh no. I think I just heard an oof. I think one of my siblings. Oh no, wait. Are we at the airport? Oh my gosh, that wasn't far at all. We totally could have walked. Or got, like, scooters or something. All right. Get to the end of the road. <laughs> Is everyone here? Oh, my gosh, it's Dad. How'd you get here so fast? All right, that was a bit weird. Dad's like, perfect. Everyone's here now. How did you get here, though? Dad's like, I forgot to tell you. Flying over that shortcut is illegal. You've broken the law. You're all criminals. We're now on the lam. Dad's like, hopefully nobody saw you. Um, I mean, we were we were flying close to the airport, so probably someone did see us. Dad's like, the airport is just around the corner. Let's keep moving. All right, Dad, you lead the way. Is it this way? I'm very slow. <laughs> All right, I think it's this way. Yeah, he's coming. It's right there. Yeah, there it is. Cool. All right, we've made it to the airport. First things first, let's get some snacks. Everyone knows as soon as you get to the airport, you immediately need snacks. Okay, hurry up, Dad. You're so slow like running in slow motion okay next we're gonna have to cross this road and we got to be careful of traffic okay ah! i wasn't careful is everyone okay or did i lose my legs oh no i think everyone's okay dad's like that was close now hurry inside well they really got to work on the traffic issues outside the airport okay baggage drop oh no i forgot my bag oh no my outfit oh Welcome, please drop your baggage for a ticket. Oh, the flight, the flight to Rohamas is leaving in five minutes. Oh my gosh, we are so late. Oh, that's our flight. Dad, why did you take us to the airport so late? Dad's like, I already have my ticket. Get yours before the plane takes off without us. Okay, um, uh, I don't have a bag. Uh, do I still need to, yeah, no, I still need to get a ticket. Okay, get your ticket and go through the boarding gate. Okay, where do I get my ticket? Um, okay, let's just queue up here. Excuse me, I need my ticket. Oh, please drop your baggage first. Oh, no, I do have my bag. Oh, thank goodness. All right. Okay, drop my bag off. See you later. Didn't even bring my cookie shirt. Um, let's go pick up my ticket. Thank you very much. Have a safe flight. Thank you so much. Gotta run to get to the gate. Okay, excuse me, could you check my ticket, please? Would you like to see my ticket? Hurry up, Dad! There's intense music happening. Oh no. Where are you supposed to go? Get your ticket and go through the boarding gate. But which boarding gate? Are we at the right gate? Dad, you're supposed to check the gate. Dad's like, no more waiting. Let's go. Okay, but where are we going? All right, come on. Oh, the door's just open. This way, everybody. Hello, I've got my ticket. My ticket to the Rohamas. Can I please get through? That is our plane. <gasps> We've got to get on the plane. Excuse me, will you check my ticket? 
the airport crew is like, hello, you must be the last passengers flying to the Rohamas. Oh no, we're going to have to walk onto a full airplane. Everybody's going to be so mad at us. Airport crew says, don't worry, you're just in time. All you need to do now is go through the metal detector and you are good to go. All right, as long as we can do this quickly. No, no, somebody has gone through the metal detector and detected metal. Dad, oh, everyone's full of metal. Oh, wow. We're all made of metal. Dad's like, what? I don't have anything on me. Dad, I think you're a robot. Other than this weapon. <gasps> Dad? What do you mean? Is he joking? Was it a bad dad joke? Hmm. The airport crew says, something's not right. Please wait a moment. Rain's like, oh, no. I don't like how that sounds. I'm going to call it now. We're all robots. We're all made of metal. All right. Uh-oh. Oh, no. There's some cops coming. Oh, what do they want? Security says, you're going to have to come with us. Oh, no. They probably heard the really bad dad joke that dad made about having weapons in the airport. Uh, is there a problem, officers? Okay. All of you were caught flying over a restricted area. <gasps> You're in big trouble! Oh no, they saw me in my tiny plane! Wait here until we get all the paperwork ready. Hmm, don't know if I will be waiting here. Might have to bust out of here, actually. Okay, let's just wait until they leave. Dad's like, sigh. I knew it was a bad idea. Uh, if you knew it was a bad idea, why did you suggest it? Or you could have just told us to not fly over the restricted area. Dad's like, now we're totally losing the flight. There it goes. It's starting to take off. We can't just let it take off. Let's break down this window and just run and hop onto the uh, wing. Oh, Kayla's like, what's that red thing on the airstrip? Oh my gosh, something's happening out there. <gasps> oh, that doesn't look good at all. Skeletox. Last one. My plan is finally complete. No Skeletox. Who's Skeletox? Last one. My plan is fine. You already said that. Oh, no, he's coming to the window. Ah, he's laughing. Are you enjoying the show, humans? Oh, he's very scary. Your world will soon be property of the undeads. And he's laughing some more. Ha 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 ha. First, I used angry humans to help me build an army. But now I can take over the world by myself. Okay. Don't worry. You would be part of my army, too. And then he laughs. And laughs some more. See you in the afterlife. Ha 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 ha. Then he just runs away. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. That was a great exit from Skeletox. Loved that. Okay. So, great question. Um, One of my siblings is like, what is going on? <gasps> Look, the cops are back. Let's ask them for help. That's not going to work. Um, it better be off to get this. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't think those cops are friendly. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yep. They look pretty scary. Uh, find a weapon and kill the infected cops. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. I've got a baseball bat. Don't worry. We are going to take care of these security officers. <laughs> oh, they're making scary noises. Oh, good. Don't worry. I'm just going to take care of this real quick. And we'll be on the beach in the Rohamas in no time. Cool. All right. Nice. Took care of our little um, breaking the law problem. Kayla's like, that was horrible. We got to find a way to exit this place. Look, there is vents. Try to see if we can get up there and find something. Perhaps a secret tunnel. Wow, there really is vents. Look, guys, we found an open vent. Oh my gosh, I love vents. I love escaping through a vent. <gasps> now we're in the baggage area. We could get loaded onto a plane. Hmm. Maybe we could uh, see where we end up. We need to get out of here. Quick. What are we doing again? We need to get on holiday. Wait, where is dad? You know what? I think that dad might be Skeletox. <laughs> oh no, what's dad doing? You need to keep going without me no dad oh no the skeleton curse is affecting dad 
Oh, that is terrible news. Who's gonna make our breakfast burgers? We have to do something. But first, let's get out of this place before monsters come. Yeah, that would be bad. We gotta escape the obby through the roof vent. Okay, let's head up to the roof. It's the only way we can help dad. Probably. Would be. Oh, watch out for the bags, though. Don't want to jump on any bags. Okay, let's go. Oh, no. All right, let's go this way. <gasps> Who's this? General Poncho. I didn't expect to see you again. Okay, everybody come up to the roof. General Poncho's like, looks like I'm late to the party. What? Who even are you? It's a good question. It's actually a bit of a long story. I'm Poncho, ex-general of the Robloxia State's Army. And an expert on Skeletox. Kayla's like, I heard from you in the news. Were you not supposed to be dead? What happened to you, General Poncho? I've been trying to stop this strange creature for years. Since the world depended on it, I had to fake my death. Oh my gosh, General Poncho is so dramatic. <laughs> we are the only ones left. We have to find and destroy Skeletox before the bad energy consumes us. We need to do this for our dad. We've just like left dad downstairs. <laughs> we don't even know what happened to him. <laughs> general Poncho's like, it's time to be a hero then. Follow me. All right, we got to follow the general. We've all been recruited into a special ops team to save the world from Skeletox. And you know what? I think we're the right, the right Robloxians for the job. Just tell us what we need to do, General Poncho. General Poncho's like, that way. All right. What's happening over here? Uh-oh. There's someone there. I don't know about this. Is it Skeletor? Skeletox? <laughs> or is it Dad? Who is it? Oh, no. Just a bunch of question marks. It's a person in a mask. A hoodie mask. <laughs> my, one of my siblings is just trying to hit them with the bat. Careful. This guy might be infected. Wait. Why does he seem familiar? Oh, no. It's not Dad, is it? Oh, it's going to be infected Dad. <gasps> or... Is it? <gasps> it's Ronald! Hello, General. Remember me? Just vaguely. General Poncho's like, No way. You are supposed to be dead. Us uh, so or you, General Poncho. I guess we are both supposed to be dead. But here we are. Wow, such drums. When my dark side attacked the presidential plane, we got shot in the face. Wow. That's scary. That made my curse become weaker. <laughs> my sibling just like hitting them with a bat. The only way I can be completely free is by s killing Skeletox. I still don't trust you, says General Poncho. You could be lying to us. I don't know. Hmm. You are not going to be part of this mission. Hmm. Okay. Do we really want to turn down extra help though? Ronald's like, well, I'm still going to do it, General. Who's coming with me? Oh, no. Do we have to decide between Ronald and General Poncho? There is no way my team is going with you. Hmm. We might, though. Maybe we should put it to a vote. Okay. Oh, here we go. We're putting it to a vote. Uh, General Poncho. <laughs> oh, the whole, the whole crew is like, General Poncho. <laughs> I don't think... Nobody wants to go with Ronald. Ronald, you're scary. <laughs> we don't trust you. Okay, looks like it was a unanimous vote. Ronald's gonna be so upset. All right, we choose to go with General Poncho. Sorry, Ronald. General Poncho's like, stay out of our way, Ronald. We are saving the world. But I mean, like, also, Ronald, if you just want to try to kill Skeletox or whatever, that's cool. I don't really mind. Um, okay, cool. All right, got my bat. This is the place where all that evil energy comes from. I guess we should hit it with a bat then. What is that noise? <gasps> oh no! Oh no! It's... They found us! Oh, ah! Oh, hate that noise. Alright, quickly! Get to the end of the maze before those infected passengers come and, um, make scary noises at us! Oh no! Oh no, they're coming! Oh, careful! Okay, everyone. There's <laughs> quite a few skulls in this maze. Ah! Okay. We just gotta... Try to find a way out of here. I hate it when they yell. <laughs> okay. 
Unfortunately, it looks like a lot of people have perished in this maze. Ooh. Ah! Creepy. We've got like a little, um, it's like a shrine to Skeletox, which is pretty scary. Um, cool. So what are we doing here? Just chilling? I think they're coming. Um, so I think they're coming. Maybe we should go elsewhere. General Poncho's like, what is this place? It looks like an evil altar. Yeah, it kind of does look like an evil altar. Someone must have summoned Skeletox. Okay, can we unsummon him? Like put him back in the box? This glowing plane looks like an offering. Hmm, very dark. Oh no, I'm falling. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I've fallen into a pit. What is this place? Oh no, General Poncho, what have you got us into? General Poncho's like, what is this place? I already said that, actually. Look up there. What, what is it? <gasps> oh no, it's Ronald. He's in a cage. Ronald's like, you were right, General. You were right. What, what were we, what was he right about again? I can't even remember what he said. Oh no, Skeletox is totally here, isn't he? <gasps> oh no. Oh my, Pilot Kylie. I thought she was dead. <laughs> Everyone was dead and is no longer dead. Oh, it's Jack and that guy. Who is that again? <laughs> Poor Jack. Nobody remembers who he is. General Punch is like, quickly, we have to get them out. We got to save Ronald and, um, and Pir Pilot Kylie and that guy. <gasps> Uh-oh, Skeletox is like, it's too late. No, Skeletox, no. Oh, no, he's huge. What's he saying? He's like, I have harvested enough scared souls to have my full power. Why do you think I go after planes? I don't know, Skeletox. It's the easiest way to get souls together, scared for their lives. <laughs> I just used Ronald because I did not have enough power to do it myself. But now I do. Get ready to be harvested too. No! Don't harvest my ah! Don't harvest my soul! <laughs> no! <laughs> okay, gotta find a way to kill Skeletox. Ah! It's like he's making earthquakes. Big boomy earthquakes. Okay. How to kill Skeletox. Maybe I could uh, sneak up behind him and hit him with the bat. Ah! Hit him with the hit him with the bat! Oh, maybe I need the sword. Ah! No, no! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, he got me! Yeah, I want to continue. Please. I need to go back. I need to find out what happens. All right, cool. All right, we're going back in. Regenerate. Okay. Oh, my gosh, I've got the sword. <gasps> I've got the sword. I'm going to be the hero today. Okay. Just got to time this just right. Don't want Skeletor to... Skeletox to see that I've got the sword. Okay. I just gotta get behind him. No, no, don't look at me. Don't look at me. Oh, you're too slow. Okay, and then strike. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> okay. No, 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 no. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, and then strike. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got him. I got him. Just keep striking. Strike, 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 strike. Wow, is this doing anything? Okay. I don't know if this is actually working. Blah! No, 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 no. Nope, nope, don't, don't, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Ooh, look, the sword is regenerated. Everyone else try to get a sword. Well, where is everybody else? Oh no, maybe I'm the only one left. Well, that's not good. <gasps> Ooh, okay, I think that my, it looks like he did lose health. So this did work. Okay, let's just try to get get around back. Okay. Let's get him. Ah! Ah! Oh, no! <laughs> no, no! Get up, get up, get up, get up! Okay, 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 we're good, we're good. Okay, I'm gonna get... Get to skeleton. All right, Skeletox. Yeah, you think you're so clever. But I'm gonna get ya. 
just gotta wait for the right moment. Nope. 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 Ah! This is harder than it looks. Okay, I gotta do this. I gotta do this for dad! Okay. Oh, there we go. I'm nice and close. Ah, oh, it's really hard to get him. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Now yeah, run. Yeah, there we go. Getting you in the face. <laughs> How do you like that, Skeletox? Just... There we go. I'm really getting him this time. Oop, nope, just gonna get out of the way. Oh, I think that I've pretty much almost killed him. Okay. Oh, no. Uh. Okay, here we go. Nope, nope. Man, I just gotta get in there one more time. I reckon I'll be able to finish him off. General Poncho, are you okay? Yeah, you could help instead of just crying, but that's cool. Um, okay. It's all up to me now. General Poncho is crying in the corner. All of my siblings have perished. Dad is still at the airport, probably. Um, Ronald's in a cage. Everything's gone to ashes. And it's all up to me now. Okay, just gotta wait for the perfect moment. And then I will save the world. Single-handedly. Just me and Skeletox. Who I keep accidentally calling Skeletor, but that's fine. Whoa! Oh, that was really close. I thought that he just bashed me into the ground. But I can't be finished off that easily. Oh, okay, there we go. Ooh, nope, nope, nope. This is hard to time. It's like, I don't want to get crushed, but I got to be close. Oh, there we go. Yep, get him, get him, get him. Yeah, right in the face. I'm getting you in the face, Skeletox. Yep. Surely you are almost dead. Almost dead. Don't you run away from me. Come on. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh, he's like on the verge of... Oh, there he goes. No, oh, he's sinking into the ground. He's like... Aah! Yeah. How about it? What happens next? Okay, I guess... Oh, nope. We've got some sort of explosion happening. Oh. What happened? <gasps> oh my gosh. What happened? You did it, soldiers! Skeletox is gone for good! Oh, okay. No thanks to you, General Poncho. Let's get everyone out of here! Okay, cool. <laughs> we can do this. Alright, so does that mean that we get to go to the Rohamas? Oh, no, it's the president talking! The nation of Robloxia is grateful once again. I want to congratulate these brave heroes for bringing the evil to an end. I would also like to thank everyone. You saved my life, says Ronald. Um, good job, soldiers, says General Poncho. Enjoy the moment. You deserve it. Wow, look, everyone's dancing, Pilot Kylie says. I've been trying to finish with Skeletox for a long time. And finally, he is gone. I know Dad would be proud. Oh my gosh, have we got the same dad? Are we siblings? Wait. What about our dad? Yeah. What about our dad? Is he still at the airport? Jack's like, wait, who's that over there? Is it dad? <gasps> What's up, family? Did you miss me? Oh my gosh, it's dad and he's invisible. Wait, no way. Hello, Doug. I did miss you. Oh, are they? Wait, Kylie is our mom? What is going on? Okay. Plot twist. Dad's like, that's right. And the family is finally complete again. Wow, what is going... This makes no sense. <laughs> Isn't this amazing, General? General Poncho's like, I don't know you. I don't really care. Wait. The General is gone. What? Heh, <laughs> says Ronald. We can be sure. Wherever he goes, he will be saving the world. What is happening? <laughs> I'm so confused. And yay! It's Airplane 4, the game where nothing really makes sense. But we love it. We love it anyway.